Hi everyone, welcome to a new video that I'm going to review a new item that I bought on the internet. This item today uh, is something that I purchased on AliExpress. As you can see, it's quite a big box. These are, these are my hands, so it's quite big. And I'm very excited about what's inside. Uh, let's open the box. As you can see, the seller uh, packaged it quite well. And he did a very good job uh, packaging it so it won't be damaged while it's delivered to me. It's not so difficult to open it. I'm always trying to do my best to keep the package because if something happens and I'm going to send it back to the seller so it won't be uh, uh, too, too much of a trouble for me to use the old uh, package with all the details on it, you know, so I can send it back to the seller, but I hope that it won't happen this time. I don't see any reason why it should happen. Not sure if you realize what's inside, but I can only tell you that it's quite a, a retro thing, something from my childhood. Okay, so as you can see, it's a video game console. Uh, it's supposed to be an 8-bit video game console like I used to play in the 90s as a child. Uh, the reason that the package is quite big is because I bought two of these. But as you can see, this is the box. The item is... Uh, the model, this is the model, HST002, uh, high image quality, on the package they write 3D graphics, I'm not sure about that because I don't remember any 3D, 8-bit uh, uh, video game uh, demonstrating 3D graphics, uh, spectacular color maybe, I don't know, for 9080 maybe, uh, digital stereo sound, uh, it's not me to judge, and high-tech controller well the controller you know it's not about the controller it's about the quality of the controller and uh, if it's durable so this is the package again you can see it's quite small compared to the items uh, to the video games that I used to have uh, back in the 90s it was uh, like a, a copy of uh, the Nintendo Entertainment, uh, Entertainment System, NES, by Nintendo. It was quite the same, you know, in the Sega 8-bit uh, console. So, this thing, I bought it as, uh, you know, because I like things from my childhood to remember and to see if someone else also likes it and so we can play, you know, uh, Super Mario and whatever. The games on the back, they show you games that I'm not sure if they are so relevant for this uh, video game. Like uh, this basketball, Ninja Turtles, Mario, whatever, Street Fighter. Anyway, let's open it. Inside the package, we have this video game. This is the console, that's it. Like, it's not big at all. This is the place you plug in the both uh, con uh, controllers this is the power button it clicks and stays inside when you press it and press it again this one I guess it's the reset button it's okay it's very light this thing it's not so big this thing I guess this is where you put the cartridge so you just lift it up to cover you lift it up like if you want it to stay, I have to say this is not an amazing quality, build quality of this thing. You have to press it a bit. So you take it up, take the cover off, take the lid, and then this is the place for the cartridge to go. Uh, in the back you have this, I guess, uh, for the charger, for the power supply, this is for the audio entrance, and this is the video uh, entrance. So that's it, this is the thing itself, 
over here it shows you that you have a 9 uh, watt or volt whatever I'm not sure because I'm not so good in electricity and stuff and uh, that's it like it's very light I guess it's not so uh, high-tech this thing also the package offers you a cartridge with 400 games I'm not sure about the games it looks very similar to the cartridges when I used to play as a child but it's a little bit smaller I can I still have those uh, cartridges from back then and they're a bit bigger but it's quite the same you know it's the same as you can see fits here and that's it it's supposed to work like it's not supposed to be very uh, difficult to play with it uh, but I used to remember I, re I remember that I used to have a button which uh, push the cartridge outside when you want to change it but uh, right now uh, we don't have it anyway let's go to the uh, joysticks they are very light I already told you that they tried to do a joystick similar to the PlayStation uh, joysticks. It's not the same. You feel that it's something very simple, very stupid. The build quality, like you see here at the edges, it's not so amazing how they did that, but it's nice and the buttons feels okay. So I guess for the comparing to the 8-bit uh, consoles that I used to play as a child, the simple ones, it's okay not amazing but it's okay like uh, just to to bring up memories it's supposed to be very good so we have both of them and i look at them right now and they both of them seems nice so i guess it's okay the length of the cable i'm not i'm not sure i'm not going to uh, measure it but it's not so big and here you have the audio video cable two bananas each side not sure if you call it bananas this is how I call it and this is the charger for the uh, machine itself the adapter AC DC adapter I'm not sure if I can use these uh, plugs in Europe like in my country uh, which is located in the Middle East so I should make, make sure of that but it's not supposed to be a problem anyway these are the things that are inside the box right now i'm going to make sure that it connects plugs to my tv with no problem and i will demonstrate to you okay so right now i'm going to plug into my tv audio goes into audio video goes into video let's see right now the machine itself it's connected as you can see joystick from the back you have uh, the charger audio and video cable is connected i'm going to switch right now nothing happens nothing happens it's not working i'm so disappointed right now nothing happens with this shit. it's not working so disappointed Switching from AV, nothing happens. Switching to TV, nothing happens. Okay, so the first game doesn't work. I have another one, and since I have another one, I'm going to open the second box and to make sure if the second device is working properly. If the second device is not working properly, then I guess that the second device is also not good and the whole uh, deal is rubbish. As you can see, it's a different package because the joysticks are different from the previous uh, joystick that was in the first package. So I'm going to open this package i'm going to connect the second device and i'm going to check if it's working if it's going to work then i will understand that one of them was damaged and i will try to contact the seller to make sure that he uh, uh, takes care of the damaged uh, item if the both of them are not working so i uh, warn you right now 
not to get this uh, device and uh, anyway let me check first before I'm jumping to conclusions so let's make sure of that uh, one thing I have to mention right now the uh, second package which I, which I received you can see that the charger is different from the charger that I received in the first package the both of them are not similar you can see that this charger is very different from this charger so the Chinese in the Aliexpress they sent me two different uh, items which are not similar to each other although I ordered the same thing so I'm going to plug electricity now I'm connecting the uh, electricity to the device itself okay you can see that this is the video game video console I'm going to uh, charge uh, press inside the audio the video and that's it right now it's supposed to work I'm pressing power on and let's switch it to AV AV not working still not working this is rubbish this thing I'm so disappointed right now you don't realize how much I'm disappointed from this thing so both video games are not working both of them are very poorly executed not working the experience of uh, the purchase was very disappointing and uh, what can I say like I bought this on the November 11th like the singles day uh, a sales day that Aliexpress they did and I guess that they are selling junk on the uh, November 11th uh, singles day like it's worth nothing everything they did sell there on that same day I bought several items I hope that the rest of the items that I'm going to receive from Aliexpress are worth anything anyway this video game is not worth anything it's uh, useless and it's worthless and I'm going to write to the seller that it's not working and that I'm very disappointed and like I have this uh, PlayStation uh, a fake uh, joystick anyway I'm gonna stay with the plastic no experience no joy no nothing from this video game not from this console I'm so disappointed but I'm sharing with you this video in order for you to realize that this thing is not working if you try to buy 8-bit console like this thing which I'm showing you right now from Aliexpress I will give you the link and you will keep stay away from this video game thank you for watching this video and I will update you the moment that I have news from the seller I'm going to write it now and I'm going to update you what's happening okay so before I decided that I'm going to quit I thought to myself wait a minute you have a USB a device that captures video so maybe if my TV is not working maybe I can use it in order to capture the uh, video from the video game to my computer so I'm uh, using the machine right now I'm uh, using the software, the device, I'm, it's turned on right now and it's supposed to show me the video game but as you can see nothing happens because it's not working nothing happens, you see something here it's supposed to work and it's not working anyway I'm going to turn it on again, turn it off maybe reset, reset button nothing happens I don't care about that settings function video settings default nothing supposed to be so complicated they're just supposed to connect the video game and it's supposed to work you know and it doesn't work so what can I say like I, I threw my money for nothing I'm so disappointed right now you don't even realize how bad it is that uh, I'm throwing money it's uh, small money it's change but still money is money and this video game is worth nothing so uh, both devices are not working I'm so disappointed 
and I'm going to send it back to the seller. I'm going to uh, uh, write to him. I'm going to hear what he has to say. And after that, I will update you because I want you to know and not to throw your money for nothing. Hi, everyone. So I would like to update you that today I contacted the seller. I notified him about the item which wasn't working properly. Both items that I purchased on AliExpress and his response was very quick to me so i told him listen like this doesn't work i tried everything i could i tried to uh, work it on my tv on my computer all the devices that i have nothing works and uh, he just uh, wanted after he tried to make sure that it doesn't work like two three times we wrote to each other and he sent me my money back to my paypal account he did the transaction and it, in less than one hour, I got my money on the PayPal account. So I got all my money back, which is nice. I didn't expect that it would be so easy. So at least there are several people which they know how know to admit that they did something wrong. I'm not sure if it shows that the seller, he knows that his, what he's selling is not worth anything or just he makes so much uh, money and he's very successful and uh, he was able to give me my money and get rid of me a uh, third uh, option which i would like to believe that uh, he is a man of honor and he really takes his uh, job response he has responsibility for his uh, items the things that he sells on the internet anyway i'm really disappointed that it's not working but i can give uh, two thumbs up for the seller for the communication and his response he took uh, he took uh, responsibility over this uh, transaction and that's nice to know that there are people who do that anyway my experience with this uh, 8-bit console video game is not so good I hope that if you got the chance to order it the HST 002 it works for you and if not then you should know that it's not uh, working at least not for me Thank you for watching this video and bye bye.